the befriending service is going to work by um, a team, a committee that's been set up by the Paul Parton Fund and Morrison Hospital Renal Unit. Um, and it's going to be supported by a clinical psychologist who will train current patients and carers to befriend new patients. Um, so it's giving the new patients support and advice to help them through their journey. So the idea being that um, current patients or carers will have um, gone through the experience and have, have learned to come to terms with living with renal failure. So they'll be able to help new patients in their journey. Kidney failure has affected my life quite a lot. Um, it affects almost everything that you do from what you eat and drink to if you're having home dialysis, what time you go to bed, what time you wake up. Um, it affects what you wear because sometimes you like to cover your fistula. Mm. Uh, I think the befriending service is very important. Um, it's important that patients are supported not only physically but emotionally as well. Well the befriending service, um, there has been a service for a little while which has been run by the Welsh Kidney Patients Association and um, but what I think what we've realised is, is there are many more patients out there that, that need to actually have this type of service so actually working with the Paul Popham Fund is actually sort of re-energising that service so that we as professionals really can work with both areas and able to provide this because I think the patients know that you know by talking to other patients they find out that they're not alone really in in having sort of kidney disease. If the befriending service was available when I was a teenager I think possibly after explaining my fears to another patient I may have been more compliant with my treatment, um, may have had some of them fears put to rest and possibly made my experience a bit easier. We've got our first uh, befriend in training course on the 27th of July. Um, we're not sure how, how often they'll be run, whether it'll be monthly, bi-monthly or quarterly, um, as this is a new new launch. Um, but the first is on the 27th of July, so we, we, we want to consistently have a stream of volunteers um, trained, ready to give new support to new patients.